this week we're going to be talking about biotechnology. Um, and you get to the course content by going in there and then clicking on the biotechnology chapter. Um, we're going to be doing chapters 9 and 10. Um, there's two chapters and anytime I have more than one chapter, um, I want you to go ahead and read the tour guide um, because the tour guide will tell you what to read and what you can skip. Helpful materials as usually you can find here. Just click on the link um, and you'll get to the PowerPoints that will help you organize the material and here's the tour guide. As usually, the chapters are linked directly from here. Um, under to see demonstrations, I've got a couple of different things. One is biotechnology, just a number of links for you to um, kind of take a look at what the kinds of things are um, that um, where biotechnology has invaded our life. Um, then here's a couple of DNA techniques that you may have heard of um, that may be part of um, your law enforcement career um, that may not be part of your career, but you may just have heard of them anyway. Um, the chapter uh, quiz is usually the critical thinking questions from the back of the chapters. This time I want you to answer two questions from each of the chapters. Um, and then I want you to talk about um, in a discussion board about DNA technology in real life and law enforcement. I'm linking two articles there that may um, bring up things that you may never have heard about before because um, as we um, as scientists, we learn things all the time. And sometimes we learn things that uh, we never expected. And uh, Lydia Fairchild is one of those stories. Um, and so these, these stories are kind of cautionary tales where um, you only know what you know and you've got to look at the evidence that you're presented with, um, you know, both in science and law enforcement um, to make up your mind. Um, and then, um, I want you to, when after you read, uh, look at the videos, I want you to tell me a little bit about um, those techniques. Um, do you use them? Do you not use them? What do you think about the videos? Do you have a little more understanding um, of what these things are? Um, and that's it for this week.